Hi folks, this is Mike here from the Trailer Depot on a chilly morning, uh, March morning here. We're doing a video this morning on a Bison 8314 Trail Express. Uh, this is a three horse, 14 foot living quarter with a slide out. Uh, starting up in front here, uh, on the bigger trailers, we always put a dual leg hydraulic jack, um, your batteries and your propane tank and your spare tire all on the front of the trailer. Coming down the side of the trailer, uh, electric awning is on all the bison. No matter what size bison you got, you're gonna get an electric awning. We're gonna walk around the outside first and then we'll go back to the inside. Uh, anodized aluminum side, bright side skin. Uh, we've got... Um, Wheel simulators. There, wheel simulators. Thank you. It's wheel early. 16-inch tires. 16 inch tires on this. Dual stop lights, load light in the back. Uh, your light switches are right here in the back. One for the load light, one for the dome light. Um, stud divider. We order all our living quarter trailers in with a stud divider on the first stall. So what that does is gives you, you can use your first stall as a mudroom coming into your living quarter or use it for extra tack, hay, any type, that, any type of thing like that that you're not going to get uh, underneath your horse's feet. Yeah, and these bisons have really nice slam latches on them. Very nice slam latches and great padding on the dividers. Huge pads on the dividers. Uh, on the eight foot wide trails, we normally order them in with the mangers too. Gives you a lot of extra room on the outside that we'll show you for storage, but it's a great way to feed the horses as you're going down the road as well. It's a drain. Um, don't have to worry about hay nets hanging that uh, could potentially cause an accident. Uh, lined and insulated ceiling, a roof vent above each horse in the horse area. Um, even on the trails with the mangers, we still have a collapsible wall on the, the rear tack, so you can collapse that down a little bit. Uh, the other really cool thing that I think the bison does is they leave the, the back of the manger open so you can put long stuff in there. Whether you've got poles or anything like that that you need to access from the back, even your fold-up chairs, it makes it nice. Saddle rack is removable on this unit. Um, then you also have a couple of large doors getting into the manger on the outside. Drop-down doors above each, in front of each horse with a uh, drop-down bar. So you can either you know, put, just put the windows down and drive with the bars open, or you can open the window and drive with the, leave the windows up. The other nice, real nice thing, and then we're going to go right into the inside, is Bison always puts this little latch on the door for their um, escape door, which is great if you're, you can get from the outside in as well as from the inside out, whereas if you only have this bar lock, you can't get out from the inside of the trailer. Big slide out on these trailers, too. There's even a step on the escape door. Step on the escape door. Look, notice the way it comes out. It comes out on an angle, so nobody's going to trip off of it, fall off. Uh, going from the first stall right into the bathroom. Big bathroom, large shower. Even a big guy like me can fit in that shower there. Plenty of room on the commode. A big closet. It's even got hanger in the closet, so if you want to take your uh, shelf out, you can use that as a hanging closet or use it as a... Um, what do, what do you call those closets in the bathroom there? I don't know. Yeah, the bathroom uh, closet. Yeah, bathroom closet. <laughs> um, another hanger in here where you can hang your shirts in here as well if you take the shelf out or use it just as a shelf. That's really nice if you have nice Joe shirts. You don't want to get wrinkled. Absolutely. And then also you set up for your TV. You've got this particular one's got a DVD, AM, FM, CD, DVD, and iPod. And iPod hookup. That's right with the USB port. And you're set up right here to plug right into the back of your TV. Uh, antenna up on the roof. Uh, air conditioning and furnace is a standard on all the bisons. This is a cool floor plan. It's a 14 foot floor plan. So what that gives us is a dinette on one side and this is a big dinette. I mean two big guys can fit on each side of this. You got plenty of room here. So four people comfortably at the dinette. Most of the dinettes are so small you can't even fit in them. And then a sofa on this side that folds down into a, folds down into a, a bed. That also folds down into a bed. So a lot of sleeping in this floor plan. The other nice thing is above the dinette, you have the extra storage. Yes, cabinets above the dinette. That's an option that we did order in in this trailer. Three burner cooktop. We ordered this one in with an oven. There's not very many horse trailers that have an oven in them, but all the ladies we hear, they like to bake cookies at the horse shows or when they're out camping. Great, great feature to have that. Big double bay sink with cutting boards on top. Large refrigerator. The other cool thing is the steps going up into this gooseneck. Very easy to get up into the up onto the bed in the gooseneck. A couple of big shirt closets up here, one on each side. 
They have hangers up top just like the other ones. Privacy curtains that come across so you can crash and stay away from your guests up in the front. And then another big closet up in the front with mirrors. Lots of storage in this trailer. It's a great trailer, great floor plan. This is Mike from the Trailer Depot. You can find us on the web at thetrailerdepot.com. Like us on Facebook and also watch us on YouTube. Thanks and have a great day.